guys! Hello! What's up? Welcome back to my channel. So if you're new to my channel, hello, I'm Din Din. So today, I would like to share with you my daytime skincare routine plus a get ready with me video. So gumawa ako ng step-by-step um, -step, uh, daytime skincare routine ko before ako naglalagay ng makeup. And then I did this look. May pagka-summer look. Peachy vibe yung naisip kong gawin. So then I used mostly local brands. So, sana magustuhan ninyo and sana matry nyo rin on your own. And now, let's get into my skincare routine and my makeup tutorial. So, guys, nung nag-shower ako, ang ginamit kong facial wash ay itong Human Nature Acne Defense Facial Wash. So, ito yung Holy Grail facial cleanser ko. Kung curious kayong malaman, um, this has been my go-to ever since na-discover ko siya that it's working effectively on my skin. Alam niyo yung dati nagkakaroon ako ng mga acne paminsan-minsan, nabawasan ng bongga dahil dito. And also, it's organic, it's local, and it's affordable. So, hindi nyo na kailangan lumayo pa. I suggest you try this. Lalo na kapag oily skin din kayo. Ang next na step ko, after ko maligo at maghihis, ito namang Human Nature Acne Defense Facial Toner. So, ganun din. Parehas sila na nilain galing din siya dun sa T3 line din nila. So, wala ako ng cotton. Then, hinisin ko na yung face ko using this. And ito, holy grail ko rin to. As in, yung combination ng acne defense, facial wash, and toner nitong human heart nature. Sobrang na-improve talaga nila yung skin ko. Nakakatuwa. So, kung oily kayo, kagaya ko, I highly suggest you try this one. Next ko naman na gagawin is to apply serum on my face. So, Olay Total Effect 7-in-1 Daily Serum. So, medyo pricey na to, guys. I think ang regular price nito is $7.99. So, every time na may sale sa Lazada or sa Watsons, kahit na hindi pa ako nauubusan ng isa, bumibili na ako kaagad. Kasi, yun nga, may pagkamahal siya. Ginagawa ko isang pump lang. Tapos, ina-apply ko siya sa skin. May nung mga nagtatanong, kailangan ba talaga ng serum? Actually, it's just an added step. If you really want yung magkaroon ng effectiveness yung, yung skin care routine nyo, maganda na mag-add kayo ng serum. Kasi yung serum, it penetrates deeper into the skin compared to yung mga cream moisturizers. So, yun yung kaibahan nila. Kaya mas maganda mag-serum ka muna bago ka mag-moisturizer. Now, effective ba to sa akin? Well, ang habol ko kayo sa kanya yung anti-aging effect niya. And so far, wala pa naman ako masyadong wrinkles. I'm already 30 years old, FYI. So, in fairness naman, I've been using this, I, I guess, for two years now, actually, medyo na late akong itry siya kasi nga medyo na mamahalan ako noong umpisa. Pero when I really try to invest uh, in skincare, doon ko mas nakita talaga nga yung effect nila. So, okay. So, after the serum, punta naman ako sa main moisturizer ko. For daytime, ang pinaka-bet ko talaga itong Celetech moisturizer. Lagi-lagi ko itong ginagamit. Lagi ko itong pinapakita sa mga kids ko. Kasi nga, sobrang lightweight niya for daily use. Alam mo yun, parang, parang wala kami nalagay sa skin. Parang lang siyang tubig, parang siyang gel. So, it really, really works for oily skin. So, after everything is absorbed by the skin, siguro iwan mo lang muna yung skin mo for 2 to 3 minutes, I now apply itong sunblock ko, which is the Bella Sun Expert SPF 40 for the face. Guys, kung tatanungin nyo ako kung ano talaga yung pinaka-pinaka-effective na skincare product for anti-aging, it's the sunblock. I'm telling you guys, iba ang effect ng UV rays ng sun. Like, siya yung talagang culprit kung bakit tayo tumatanda. Aside from aging itself, of course. Pero pag nag-birthday tayo taon-taon, nakakatanda yun talaga. It's a given. Pero, the more na expose ka sa araw, kasi wala akong sun protection, mas mapapabilis yung aging ng skin. Once na ma-absorb na yan sa skin, I go straight to my makeup. The for base, ang, ang gagamitin ko yung DLK All Day Pad Liquid Foundation. I am the shade sand.
And now for concealer, I'm using LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Creamy Beige. Okay, now for the brows, I'm using this Nichido Eye Pencil. Eye Pencil? Oh, Nichido Eye Pencil siya actually, in the shade Chestnut. So I used this for the brows. So this pencil is actually very waxy and pigmented. So I try to really apply it lightly. As you can see, konting ganun ko pa lang, may kulay na kaagad yung brows. So, I use a spoolie to brush it. Alright, so to set my makeup, I will use the Nichido Final Powder in Creamy Glow. One of my favorites, of course. Nahulas proof yung makeup natin for summer. I'll be using the baking technique. So I'll use the sponge that comes with it. So as in, ibibake ko yung buo kong mukha. Lalo na yung mga oily kagaya ko, sobrang magbe-benefit kayo sa ganitong technique. Ayan. <laughs> Medyo mukha tayo. Medyo tayo mukhang tanga. Okay. Now, I'll go straight to the eye look. So, simple lang naman yung gagawin ko. Since I'm going for a summery vibe or spring type of look, puso yung mga peachy pink colors. So, I'll use the Caroline Oil Control Blush on in the shade fresh tomato. So, super cute ng color nito. Actually, ang dalas-dalas nitong sold out sa mga stores. Even sa mga sa online shops like Lazada. Lagi siyang wala. So, I'll use itong shader brush na ganito. So, I'll apply ko lang siya sa aking lids. So, ang aim ko lang naman magkaroon ako ng monochromatic look. Uso kasi kapag summer yung mga bright colors. So, I'm just using this peachy pink blush as my eyeshadow. And then, I'll do some shading then sa lower lashes ko. So, for eyeliner, I'll use the Nichido. Oh my gosh, sobrang burato na kasi siya. Basta yung liquid eyeliner nila na black. Gamit na gamit to, kaya ganito eh. Anyway, I'll just draw a very, very thin line dito sa aking lashes. Lash line actually. Unti-unti uh, lang. Kasi yung parang, alam niyo yung parang dinadampi ko lang yung tip ng brush. And I'll do the same thing on the other eye. For us to blend in or brush away with the bake. So as you can see, our face is looking matte. Ang next kong gagawin is bronzer. So for bronzer, actually hindi talaga siya bronzer. It's, the, it's um, a powder. A darker powder. L'Oreal Dru Match super, ben super Blendable Powder in the shade C7 the same fluffy brush and just bronze up my face using this. Pwede yun guys, kapag wala kayong mahanap na gusto nyo yung bronzer, pwede kayong mag-try ng mga uh, powders, face powders na darker than your skin tone. It will work the same. Now for blush, I'm using the same thing that I used on my eyes. Yung Caroline Blush On in Fresh Tomato. I'll be doing the drunk blush technique since that is that is a favorite of ours. Since yun yung favorite look ng marami sa atin lately. So I'll use just the same brush. Tapos kinitin ko to. And I'll concentrate it first sa ilalim ng mata. Kasi ganun yung drunk blush eh. So, sobrang pigmented nito guys. Nakikita nyo naman siguro sa camera. Medyo ingat-ingat sa paglalagay. Pero kung napadami yung lagay nyo, it's okay. Kasi pwede nyo naman siyang patungan ng powder later on. Okay, para na tayong sinuntok. Joke lang. Okay, now to finish off my eyes muna pala. I will curl my lashes first. 
And now I suggest for sober use, a waterproof mascara. And this is the Maybelline Total Temptation Waterproof Mascara in Black. So this is my favorite mascara ever. Really lives up to its claims. Really gives volume and length to my lashes as you can see. And now for the lips. I will go first with the lip tint. So I'm using the Divas Lip and Cheek Tint in Sunset. Sobrang matuwa ako dito guys. Grabe ang pigment. Mm. So apply ko lang siya. It has an orangey vibe to it. Sunset nga yung color, di ba? So, parang may pagka-summer talaga yung vibe nitong lip tint na to. Okay. So, I'll just blot it first para mas konti, mas even naman siyang ma-apply. And what I will do is I'll use itong BLK uh, lipstick in the shade Stylish. So, peachy siya. Ito siya. Yeah, peachy pink actually. So it's one of my favorites from BLK. So but ako naglagay na lip tint, baka nagtanong inyo kasi para lang mas ma mas lumabas pa yung pagka peachiness ng lipstick kasi if if ito lang may pagka pinky din kasi siya. So, ang next ko naman na ilalagay is yung highlight. So, I'm using itong BLK Contour Blush and Highlight Palette. Yung highlighter lang yung kukutin ko. I mean, yung gagamitin ko. So, dip ko lang yung finger ko dito. And then, I strategically apply it. So, high points ng face. I'm not using a brush kasi wala lang. Gusto ko lang itry. <laughs> Pwede rin naman kasi na walang brush kapag lalagay kayo ng ganito. And now, para hulas proof talaga yung makeup natin, I'll use the Eliana Stay Fresh Setting Spray. Guys, I was blown away by this product. Mahal siya for a local brand kasi 599 pesos siya. And it only contains 60 ml. Pero guys, gulat ako. I use this on myself. I use this on my clients. And lahat sila nagsasabi na uh, nag-last yung makeup nila. And sa akin din, nag-last yung makeup ko nung ginamit ko ito. Idalay ko na yung konti yung mukha ko mga ganito. <laughs> Teka nga. Ayan. Nakalang. Tapos, spray ako lang aking face. Hmm. And guys, isa pa palang makakomment ko sa kanya. Yung bonus dito sa product na to, it's mineral based. Pwede sa pregnant, pwede sa sensitive skin, or kung gusto nyo talaga yung mga mineral makeup, grabe to. Natural based ingredients. Hindi siya harmful sa skin. Kasi alam ko, hindi advisable na lagi kang gagamit ng setting spray. And nung lumabas yung Eliana, Elia, nagkaroon, na, nagkaroon ng setting spray yung Eliana, tas mineral based. Parang, oh wow. Kakaiba yun ah. Kasi, ibig sabihin, it will be great for everyday use. Kasi nga, mineral based siya. So, ayun. So, that is it, guys. My look is done. So, nakalimut ako palang banggitin sa inyo. Kaya lang talaga ako nag-makeup din kasi pupunta kami na mama ko sa, sa mall. Guys, thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye!